Hey, hey, hello to everybody out there. Welcome to CLO Pixel Gamers. Today's video is all about those sports games that just got it right. I'm pretty sure we all enjoy our Disney characters, but today we're not talking about Disney sports basketball. No, we're actually talking about those sports games that anybody can pick up and play and really enjoy. So let's get started. How do I catch it? Just stand there and stick your glove out in the air. I'll take care of it. There was no other sport more classic to America than baseball. Back in the days, The Sandlot was my go-to baseball movie that I always loved to watch. That movie reminds you of those days of collecting baseball cards or getting up with your neighborhood friends and getting a game of baseball in. But on those rainy days or when you just couldn't scratch that itch, Baseball Stars 2 was here. Baseball Stars 2 SNK In this game you can select from 18 teams across two different leagues. What makes this game different is the animation, the power-ups, and the fast-paced gameplay that keeps you addicted to it time and time again. The Neo Geo version of this game was critically acclaimed. The first issue of Game Fan Magazine gave it a score of 99 and 97% quoting that it is a far and away the best sports game I have ever played. Also saying that the graphics are incredibly well detailed and the gameplay is unparalleled. I have to admit, this is my go-to game before I start heavily gaming, as it is fast paced, quick, easy and fun to play. This is my warm up game and my go-to and I suggest you give Baseball Stars and Baseball Stars 2 a try. The National Basketball Association has created many iconic games and players since June 6, 1946 in its inception in New York. Players like Kobe, Iverson, and Jordan created some spectacular moves and feats that couldn't be ignored. These talents led to the desire to highlight them through leagues such as the And One and also Slam Dunk Contests, thus the inception of NBA Street. People! I have witnessed the future, seen visions of what's to come. And I've seen change, drastic change. It's the housing of the old. And rejecting our routine. I've seen cats getting shook, taken to the bar, hooked up passes. Bringing freedom to the masses. Oh, it's crazy. Hey, stand up, rise up. NBA Street Volume 2, rated E for everyone. Street ball will never, ever be the same. EA for this new effects in EA Canada Brainchild was released in 2001 by EA Sports Big for the PlayStation 2 and in 2002 for the GameCube. This game combines the talent and big names of the NBA with the attitude and atmosphere of street ball. This 3v3 basketball game allows you to collect trick points which gives you special skills. These points allow you to do fancy dribble moves, fake outs, shot blocking, driving the ball and dunking. You get to select from 29 NBA teams with rosters from 2000 and 2001, but only 5 players from each team are selected. This game was a commercial success, selling in the US 1.7 million copies, earning $57 million. I must admit this is my go-to basketball game when I'm building up my character or just getting a long session of basketball in. This basketball game will have you hooked for hours, even if you're not an NBA fan. Although NBA Street represents the innovation into basketball games, I wouldn't do this video justice if I didn't talk about the infamous NBA Jam Tournament Edition. NBA Jam can be considered the series that started it all and let everyone know that sports games were for everyone. Adding good moves, announcers, super moves, and highlights is what made this game special. NBA Jam was developed by Midway in 1993. This series has 13 games that range from 1993 to 2011. 
The project leader for this game was Mark Trammell and was heavily based on TV basketball in 1974 and Arch Ravels in 1989. <laughs> <laughs> The aggressive basket brawl style of Arch Rivals and its aggressive gameplay was added with tons of extra features such as the super dunk and the, the announcement we all love. Also unlockable secret characters such as Scorpion from Mortal Kombat and Bill Clinton. Because this game evolved and is also available on so many platforms is the testament of the great abilities of Midway and the NBA Jam series today. If you're looking for a basketball game that anyone can enjoy, from tykes to grandparents, this is it, NBA Jam. 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 The sport of boxing is known for precision, accuracy, stamina, and being able to knock your opponent out with one hit. No matter what era of boxing you come from, the core of the sport remains the same, to be the last man standing, to best your opponent, and to also overcome your obstacles. That's good. <laughs> I told you it's okay. Now wait. Now we try the other lamp. Now look here, will you? Now tell me. I see it. Now you see nothing. Creed would have caved in the whole side of your face. Now forget it, kid. You got the heart, but you ain't got the tools no more. Now forget it. Huh? Yeah, that's it. Now look. You didn't even see that coming, did you? No. Well, that was from a broken down pug like me. What do you, what do you think the champ would do to you? We can't talk about a greater game than Punch-Out! and Nintendo got this one right. Whether you're playing Mike Tyson's Punch-Out, Super Punch-Out, or Punch-Out for the Wii. With every press of the button, it felt like you were actually in the ring with all the dodging, blocking, and punching, gradually fighting harder and harder opponents to get to the end of the game. Eight games in total were developed by Nintendo from 1984 to 2018. The first game was developed by Nintendo's general manager, Genyo Takeda, and his partner, Mikado Wada. The first unit was made for the arcade in 1984 was vast differently from the Nintendo home console series. An interesting fact, Mike Tyson only made $50,000 for the title in 1987, yet there were 2 million copies sold for the Nintendo Entertainment System. Retailing at $35 each, that means that Nintendo made $70 million off of the title. Ouch. A little Mac right now, yeah, absolutely, there you go. And and you press start. Little Mac is on the attack. All Here right. we go. Ready? One, two, three. Good luck. Go. Oh. Oh. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do it, buddy. Oh. Come on, Mike. All right. All right. Come all right, on. Come on. You know AD, hey, right? Little Mac, I know, but nothing's happening. All, all right. right. There you go. Yeah, right yeah, now yeah, you go. Yeah, now you go. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Oh. Ah. Come on. Ah. He's blocking. He's blocking. Ah. 
He's blocking. Oh! <laughs> All right, that's right. He's down. Press A, B, 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 A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B, A. Get up. Get up. You're up. You're up. There you go. Fight. Come on. Back in. Come on. Go. Down. Body blow. Bo oh, yes. Oh. 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 All right. Get up. Get up. A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B, A, B. Come on. This is longer than many of the people you fought before in the real ring. Oh. You broke the oh. record. You're just oh. making yourself oh. mad. Oh. Back. Oh. 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 It's a win-win, man. My time. This game combined puzzle elements and learning the patterns of your opponents, iconic characters and animations, and great overall challenge that kept you hooked on this game. The combinations of lefts, rights, dodges, and hooks will keep you hooked for hours uh, on end. Dodge. Oh, ow. Uh, uh, ow. Uh, uh. Ouch, man. Block this. What? Come on. Uh, uh. Ow. Uh. Ouch, man. Duck this one, huh? Go on. Ow. That was a big mosquito. Duck this one. No. Go on. Go on. That was nice. Block this. Wow. Go on. Go on. That was nice. Block this. So if you're new to boxing, definitely check out this title. There was nothing more special than waking up on Saturday morning, grabbing that bowl of cereal, and watching your favorite wrestling matches from WWF and WWE. The argument was always which league was better, whether you like Bam Bam Bigelow, The Hulk, Sting, or The Undertaker. Even actors like The Rock got their start in this wrestling sport. And believe me, WWE and WWF had their share of wrestling games, but nothing felt or looked or sounded like Def Jam V for Vendetta. EA Sports. Impressive. From here, it's almost serene. Calm even. From here. But inside, it's a whole nother scene. Inside, it's just one big brawl. Used to be you wanted to make yourself known. You prove yourself as a street fighter, a hustler. We don't fight out in the streets no more. We organize now. We too gangster for the garden. So we've taken it underground. I'm a businessman, and this is my business. My rings, my rings, my crew. Method Man, Nori, Capone, Luda, DMX. You want a shot at me, you gotta make it past these brothers. You wanna take what's mine, you gotta beat me. But nobody ever beats me. Start riding, my film is bring us hiding. My John Cochran, like you riding. I shack up before you yeah, back up. Took the ring, pour it for a natural up. Smash up, crash up. Making the sound barrier. Hardcore, pull it, go for it, pull it. Got your camera on it, who's the good footage? Shit, put it up, put it up. Def Jam Vendetta. Def Jam Vendetta is a 2003 professional wrestling video game that combines hip hop with pro wrestling. This game was released for the PlayStation 2 and the GameCube by EA Sports. This was EA's first attempt at a wrestling game since the widely planned WCW backstage assault. The featured wrestlers in this game included DMX, Method Man, Red Man, Ludacris, Scarface, and more. This wrestling game added button mashing elements and more of an arcade feel, similar to WWF No Mercy. This game allows you to level up and enhance your wrestler to eventually defeat the underground boss D-Mob. If you're looking for a wrestling game with addictive gameplay, great story mode, character highlights, and hip-hop flavor, 
then definitely check out Def Jam V for Vendetta. If Def Jam Wrestling is not brutal enough for you, then maybe you need to try NFL Blitz. Fire mode and a ton of new features, including mini games. NFL Blitz 2001 is the only extreme football game available this season. The pros wish they were this hot. This game rated E for everyone. This aggressive NFL football game was released by Midway in 1997 as an arcade game. There were several football games that preceded it, such as Madden NFL or NFL 2K which were more traditional football games. Blitz, on the other hand, allowed for pass interferences, late hits, showboating, and excessive celebrations. Being able to walk the lines of illegal moves is what made this game so much fun. The key differences encourage faster and more aggressive gameplay. In the original game, seven players on the field per side. Not only were there fewer players, but the positions were flexible at best. For example, wide receivers could run the ball and pass. Defensive players were all crosses between pass rushers and defensive backs. I guarantee you, once you try NFL Blitz, you'll never play another NFL game like this one. Blitz players don't pump iron. They have it for breakfast. Deadly long-range passing, linebackers without conscience, and the biggest, baddest, most brutal players who ever walked the earth, NFL Blitz. Martez, chew your food. No refs, no rules, no mercy. Oh, i looking good, Cordell. Haven't missed one yet. Deadly long-range passing, linebackers without conscience, NFL Blitz. It's a wretched assault on the sense of fair play. Good. No refs, no rules, no mercy. Dodgeball may not be considered the most popular sport ever, but I definitely enjoyed playing it in grade school, and maybe you did too. One company definitely got this genre right, and it wasn't just dodgeball, it was super dodgeball. This SNK title was released in 1987 in Japan. What's amazing about this game is it captures every element of dodgeball, being able to catch the ball, being aggressive and fast, and making sure you're looking out for the opponent's throws. This game gives you the ability to throw from the sideline, also give power shots and many other special moves. The art style and addictive gameplay is why this game is so popular. The teams were customized based on what region of the world that you were playing this game in. So if you like dodgeball with special techniques and cool characters, this is the game for you. So these are the sports games that just seem to get it right. And comment down below. If I didn't list your genre of sport or game, definitely put it in the comment section and let me know which games or sports games you think that got it right. If you're new to the channel, please like, share, comment, and subscribe. And I'll be seeing you on the next video. Take care.